Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new vlog. Today, we are starting it off with a giant Jenga tower, and behind us is a wall of punishments. I love that. None of those are good. Usually we do challenges where the winner is safe. I figured why not just both of us get punished? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna pull a Jenga block out, and whatever number is on the bottom is what correlates to that, and we gotta do the dare. Let's go like, you know, middle. Five. What is that, an S? This is a five? Yeah. Okay. Yell loud in public for no reason. <laughs> oh my gosh, no! Guys, this is way out of my comfort zone, but I do it for you. Ah! Ah! Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, that was so stupid. All right, Mr. Noah, your turn. He wants to bring the tower down already. Oh, you're going for a side piece? 24 for Cody. Hey! Call your dad and tell them you have lice. I don't think he's gonna care. He's like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let's call my dad. Hey, sir. Hey, dad. What's happening? Nothing much. I just got lice in my hair. How'd you do that? I don't know. I think I put like someone else's hat on and just start itching. Do you know how like I could treat it? Yes, yeah, so you gotta go buy stuff, a shampoo, and a tiny comb. He's at my house right now. Am I infected? As long as you guys didn't touch heads. We just did. I'm gonna go look into it, dad. Thank you. I love you. I love you too. Keep me posted, okay? Okay, well. Always the middle ones, huh? 11, lucky number 11. Let dogs lick peanut butter off your face? No, dude, nice. no! You want some peanut butter? All right, let's do it. I feel like she doesn't want to lick it off my face. She has a lot of respect for me, guys. She would never do that. Oh, oh this is actually kind of cute. Oh, man. this is horrible. Oh. Okay, that's it. No more. Stop this bad boy down, please. 21. Do anyone? Remove your socks with your teeth. Can you even do that? I can't reach that. There's actually no way. You gotta try though. Like, I physically can't. Like, I can't. <laughs> like, there's actually no way. <laughs> yeah, that's hard. At least you gave it a try. I gave it a try. That's all that. Hey, thanks, man. Uh -huh. I hate this game. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. 22. Run on the street for 60 seconds barefoot. Ooh. <laughs> All right, guys. I just got a freaking pedicure, too, so my feet are looking beautiful. And it's a hot day today, so it's going to be brutal. This is disgusting. It's so hot. Ah. All right. Honestly, it wasn't that bad. Dude, it's hot. So the very bottom. <laughs> I'm gonna guess the number is two. Three. Okay. Frank, call your mom and ask her to bail you out of jail. There's a lot of stuff happening with my parents today. I think we've done this to her before and she didn't believe it. Hey, kid. Hello, this is a collect call from San Diego County Jail regarding inmate Noah Rojas. She just hung up. She hung up. Wait, hold on. Can I just ask why that played in slow motion? Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. Hold on, hold on. Hello, this is a glad call from... Now it's normal. <laughs> she texted him saying, what are you even doing? <laughs> Not falling for it. It's impossible to prank the moms nowadays. Ooh. 14. Eat a raw egg. Dude, that's the last dare I'm doing. Hey. Wait, let's throw it at the Lego wall. No! At least they're organic eggs. One little... Ooh. Wait, why does it look Ooh. like that? <sighs> Cheers. This is a competition to see who's smarter between Noah and I, and we're gonna be playing some Wordle. I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen this. It's super popular right now, but you pretty much start with nothing, and you have six tries to guess the word. If there's a green letter in the word you guess, that means that letter is in the word in that exact spot. But if there's a letter that turns yellow, that means it's in the word, but not in that same spot. It's kind of confusing, but you guys will see. Whoever guesses it in the least amount of tries wins. I'm gonna start with Gamer. Ah, uh, damn, that's not good. That's not good. There is an E in the word, but it's not the second to last letter. All right, we're gonna try bless. Ooh, okay, okay. So the E is there, and then there's an S at the end. Dude, if this could actually be the word, I'm gonna go with poets. Ooh. Ah, uh, okay. So there is a P in there. Oh, specs. This is it. This is it. Oh. No, okay, okay. So now we know the P is the second to last letter. So it's EPS. I have to guess it. Okay. Wow. No! I have to guess this right. Keeps. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Yes! Okay, okay, I got it. It's nothing to be proud of. It was the last row. Noah has to just guess the word before six tries. If you guess this... Okay, okay. Ooh, that's hard. Hey, that's a tough start I'm just right going there. for it. There's no E in it. Though. But you can try it. Dude. 
Ooh. Okay. Okay. So now you know it ends in an A. Okay. That was my guess, to be honest. I Flora? Because I don't know. Is that a word? I don't... <gasps> oh! oh! Dude, he helped me. Wait, Flora is a word? Listen, man. We tied. We have to do one more. I'm going to guess this one in four or less. Train. Okay. Starts with a T. Tours. Oh, no. Okay, so T. Wait. Wait, it was three? It was on the third row. Hey, Noah, um, your turn. If you don't get three, you lose, and I'm smarter than you. Okay, so it ends in an R. Dude, this is great. Hey, no, there's but- There's no L there, I know. No, but there's an O and U. You didn't put O and U in the word. Oh. Hey, holy stressing right now. I'm just gonna guess a random word. Oh. Okay. okay. I mean, you still lost, but I want to know the word. Yeah, I just- I so really want to know the word. Oh, wait. Oh! oh! I know it. You got this. Come on. No, no! Oh, I ended. <laughs> Dude! There you go. Oh. There you go. Hey, uh, was this the worst segment you've ever done? Yeah, for yeah, no. It's I'd rather jump in the pool. <laughs> if you make me laugh, you win some money. Let's see if you can do it. That, that's a <laughs> kill. <laughs> oh, oh! I smiled. <laughs> I laughed after he got off the table, man. There you go. If anyone wants to make me laugh, you have to be sitting in the chair. What's up, Pedro? What's up? How are you? Nice to meet you, Brian. Nice to meet you, bro. Back in like 2016, I would say, my homie, he was like, you know what you look like? You look like Faze Rug's sister, bro. And I was like, is it because I'm a Habibi man? That's ridiculous, bro. Like, are you are you serious? Like, that's what's going on here? You know, hey, hey. hey I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna oh, lie. Bro, I laugh because you dead ass look like my sister. Tell me we don't look alike here. Hey, Blake. Hey, of course. Oh, Appreciate you. you. What's good? What's good? Yo, do you want to make me laugh? Two fish are in a tank, right? They look to each other. They say, you know how to drive this thing? Oh. I actually don't get that. Because they're in a tank. I all get right, it now. All right, all, all right. right. That's all I got to say. Hey, I see someone with a professional raw dogger shirt. He must have the jitty on humor, right? Okay. Just put you on the spot. Just phase rugging it? Should I phase rug this one? <laughs> Yo, yo, no way. Hey, he actually got me. No. Hey, we just phase rug that one, but just make sure don't cash that at the bank or anything because like it's not gonna work. I rug the money for this one, but no one knows. Hi. I literally just watched your video like yesterday. Really? Do you have a joke that you can make me laugh with? Your YouTube career. <laughs> hey, hey, you actually got me on that. I'm not gonna lie. She was watching my video though, so like, I hope she was joking. Here, okay, you got the money now. Um, was it a prank when you said that? Yeah, it was. Oh yes, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I love you, thank you. <laughs> All right, man, what's your joke? What did? How did the dog um? um that you um you had you. He didn't make me laugh, but he he just cute. So why do seagulls fly above the sea and not the bay? Because they're down by the bay. Nah, cause then they'd be bagels. <laughs> <laughs> Can you make me laugh? Yeah, um, you look really familiar. Your name is like... I didn't recognize you without your makeup. Anything else? No. You know me from YouTube though, right? James Charles? Yeah. I don't think yeah. What do you call a cow with no legs? I don't know. Ground beef. Knock knock. Who's there? An owl. An owl who? Uh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot the rest of the, I forgot the, rest of the joke. I was not gonna laugh. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry, I laughed, I laughed. Hey, there you go, my guy. All right, guys, I'm here with my man, King, and we got his gold Bugatti right here, and I thought it would be a great idea to take it to CarMax to see what they would offer us. Let's do it. How much is this thing worth right now? So if you go online, you get a 15,000 mile 2008 Bugatti for like $1.6 million. How many miles are on this thing? 4,800 miles. So this should be worth around like the 2 million range, right? You would right? think, right? There's only 72 of these in the entire country. There's only two for sale in the world. What offer would you think is a good one for this Bugatti that you would think they're not lowballing you. Something between one five and two million, I guess. All right, let's see if we can get a really good offer for this gold Bugatti. Am I allowed to drive it? Let's go. I love this guy. I love this guy. All right. Oh, wow. Your seat is so low to the ground. Peace out, guys. I'm back, guys. Let me show you guys real quick where the emergency brake is. The emergency brake is on the very side of the car. So we just press down on it, right? Right. I act like I don't know how to drive a car, but it's a Bugatti, so you never know. <laughs> <laughs> Peace out, guys. Oh my gosh. I've never driven this on like the actual road. Oh, I've just no driven it in my community. Yo, guys, I don't know if you can hear me right now. I'm sure you can, but I'm driving a gold Bugatti, and I think this is the coolest thing in the entire world. No, your friends are temper? You know face temper? That's awesome. What's your name? You did? What's your name? My name's Icaro. Icaro? 
No way. That's awesome, bro. It's nice to meet you. All right, have a good one, okay? Here we go. Look, they're taking out their phones. Dude, this is so sick. I love this video already. Bro, driving that thing is unreal. Let's hope for one and a half million, right? Let's, Let's get it, King. It. Let's go get it. I wonder what they're gonna say. We already got some crazy reactions. Everyone was like pulling out their phones to record. So CarMax is just known to buy cars and flip them. Is that like the whole thing with? Yeah, I guess their concept is to buy cars at what they believe is a reasonable price. We just wanted to get a car valuation. It's a 2008 Bugatti Veyron. Uh, no, we're actually in the parking garage next to like a gold Bugatti. All right, perfect. All right, so we gotta go inside. He said he's gonna come out and like help us get a print. Thank you, it's his car. Nice. He's trying to sell it. So it's a pretty simple process. We're just gonna get the van off it, compare it to other sites we have. We'll do a walk in the vehicle, take some photos of it, and then we'll do a test drive if it needs it. How many miles does this thing have? This one has like 5,000. You know, let's get started on this. Let's get you a number. Yeah, if we can just get like, literally just a rough ballpark. estimate. Yeah, ballpark range of what you think the car would be worth. Just from punching in the numbers. Just give us, you know, 10, 15 more minutes. We'll see where we're at. Oh. All right. Thank you. Yo, he doesn't want them to drive his car. <laughs> Don't freaking touch my car. What are you doing in there? <laughs> Have you guys ever gotten a Bugatti? Here. This will probably be like one of the first ones super rare. I really wonder what they're gonna evaluate this at. So you think they're gonna come back with a good offer? I think so, man. This is CarMax. They're pretty fair with their customers. Yeah. Let's see what they come back with. I mean, shoot, it is a gold Bugatti. I know. So you would say you'd be happy with what, like 1.8? 1. 1.8, 1. 1.9, I think for 2008. What would be a low ball number to you? Anything less than 1.8, I think would be pretty low ball. Okay. okay. Oh, what's up, man? Uh, I came back. Damn, Nine. that's actually great. That's pretty good. CarMax is pretty good. How long do we get to think about oh, it? You have seven days to accept this offer. Yeah. Seven days. I think we should sleep on it. I think we should sell the car, get a yacht, maybe wrap it <laughs> gold. Yeah, what do you think about that one? Gold yacht? Honestly, that'd be sick. Have you guys um ever bought any Bugattis or no? Off the top of my head, I honestly have no idea. Okay. Yeah. Dude, hey, I mean, that's good. Hey, we should well, think about it. Thank you so much. Right I appreciate on. it. Yeah. yeah appreciate we'll we'll give you a time. call. Tell me back if you need anything. All right. Awesome, Thanks so, Thank so, so much. All right. Take, take care. Well, oh, Brian. 1.9? I think we should go to the local yacht show. <laughs> I did not expect them to do 1.9. That's pretty crazy. That's actually it's really in good. in line with what I thought the car would be worth. <laughs> yeah. So, but that's pretty darn fair. So I think I, you should keep it. I think maybe I should just keep it. I think I you should know. keep it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, fuck it. Let's keep it. You want to go for the drive? You take the car? I'm down. Okay, man. We're going to end the video there. Hope you all did enjoy. Make sure you drop a like, hit that subscribe button. I almost just broke the door. Peace out, everybody. Out of here.